Okay, so this is what you're going to learn on this course. This course is called Web Scraping and Data Mining. So what is that? Basically, Web Scraping, it's going to a site and extracting information from that site and then showing it into text boxes or tables. So how we're going to do that? So I want to show you some examples of something that I did. For example, this is a page uh, that shows Clickbank products that uh, are the best selling products. So basically you can promote this and you get some money. Here you have the how much they are going to pay you if someone buys from this link. Anyway, this is very interesting information that someone would be willing to pay uh, some money to get. If you can give it into a software, you can sell that software and then you can make some money. So I'm going to show you what I did here. So this page is uh, filled out with a lot of products. So I want to take all those products and show it into a software, which will be this one. So basically I'm going to type my Clickbank ID. I can search by different kind of uh, like terms. So I'm going to choose gravity. gravity is like the most uh, the best products uh, that sell for Clickbank. So I'm going to just click show and basically this is going to download all the information from this page and then it's going to show it into my software which you can see it's doing right now. So as you can see here is the Venus factor which will be the Venus factor then diabetes and you will see here diabetes. So what I did is I just took the information from this page and translated into comprehensible data and it's going to make it work for you much faster. So for example, here you can see that it create my, my affiliate link. Uh, the affiliate link is basically, this link is going to be sent to somebody else and when somebody else buy from that link, you get that commission. Anyway, the most important part here uh, is that you're going to learn how to extract all this information from different websites. So this is uh, what you got. And then you can export this into Excel. I haven't done that part, but you will be able to do it uh, the way I'm going to show you. So now let's say, uh, but this is just one product uh, of many that I have done that basically take the scraping and data mining option like to a new level. So here, this one, it's an email structure. So let's say you look on Google for marketing, marketing, then you just search emails that are related to marketing. So you see it looks on the internet and it shows different pages. Now you just load that and basically it's going to extract all the emails and it's going to add it to my list box. Then you can save those emails and use it to send a like mass email to those people. So as you can see, it extracts all the, all the HTML code and then extract every single email from there. You can save this into Excel. So the next uh, thing that you can do is you can scrap Facebook. So you can just go to Facebook directly. Then you log in into your Facebook. This is so you have access to the searching option on Facebook. And now I'm going to search on the on the fan pages. I'm going to search for something that is related to marketing or to any kind of fan page that I want to be targeting. It could be either anime, it could be make money, niches, it, it could be anything really. So I just click search. It's going to search onto Facebook. And as you can see, it showed me like the pages. I just will show a little bit more because this is what it's going to be extracting. And all these pages, I want to get the links for those pages because are related to marketing so I can then promote offers. So I just click get HTML. And basically that is going to extract the information from this page and it's going to show it to me here. Then after that, I can just extract every single page from there. So I just get the links, 250 links. I remove the unwanted links because there are a lot of links that you don't need. And then 
front page to text box. So I copy this ones here and I just copy that, open a notepad and I can just paste that. And it's much faster than be copying every single one. And then I can use this and put it into an automatic program to comment on those pages. So that's something that you can do. It really depends on your imagination. So that's one page. Now here I can just say uh, this is another program that I can scrape. It's called QGG. So I just put the, the province of Quebec. I choose the website and just click search. So this is going to go again, do the same thing. It's going to go to uh, QGG. It's going to grab the HTML code and then it's going to ch it's going to show it to me in in this way. So you have like a uh, you have like um. Uh, list of the ads then you can just email this person and like if you're interested in that you can just email email to them so these are projects that you can be doing the search uh, this this one also is, is for scrapping is co keywords pie so i just look for something called uh, montreal design and i just will look for all the pages from Montreal Design. I just click search. And it's going to show me from Google all the pages for, uh, for for that. It's going to scrap Google. And now what I want to get is the title, the description, and the keywords for those websites. So I just click get keywords for selected, and it showed me for that that didn't have keywords. And I can analyze every single one. Uh, there, like I just click analyze all the websites, and it's going to go and every single one is going to go and analyze that specific website, and then after a few seconds, minutes, it's going to show me all the keywords, all the keywords, uh, all the keywords, all the description, and all the title for that page. So, as you can see, it already showed me extract all the titles, all the descriptions. If it didn't, it's because that company they then uh, put keyword the keyword tag into the into their website so that means that you could outrank them much easier you see this this company did it properly but the other ones uh, this one also did it properly but the other ones didn't do it so then you can see like this is to analyze your competition so this is another project that you could do with the scraping this one with YouTube search terms you can just look for test uh, for the the videos that you want to target so marketing Montreal uh, marketing Montreal and then you can just click go and it's going to go to YouTube extract all the videos from YouTube's the uh, it's going to extract the title the keywords the B account so you can just look for the ones that are more with more views and then you select that one and you're going to get the the keywords for that specific video and if you do that then this is very useful because you can just uh, copy some of the keywords that they have and you will also just like um, get the traffic from them because you're going to be using the same keywords so if you have a nice video you probably can outrank them so you see these are keywords animate da, 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 da. so basically what it did it went and visited this link and download all the keywords for for that page so that's another project that I did and actually it's like unlimited what you can do with website scraping so this is uh, what you're going to learn on this course so hopefully you like it um, this one I'm just going to show you this last uh, project which is going to be uh, a way of looking on YouTube and created, creating website through YouTube. So uh, this is going to be very fun. So I'm going to just show you, if you wanted to make a video site, you could do something like marketing. So I just click marketing, I click go. It's going to go on YouTube. It's going to extract everything there from YouTube, the title, the description, the view count. Then what I can do is I just put, go to create site, I go to browse. I create a new folder, I call it website marketing and then I just uh, like click OK I choose my domain if I, if I had the domain, this uh, domain, I just have these domains if I don't have them anymore I'm just going to create my, my new, do like I'm just going to type my new domain 
which would be Jose Garcia that's the A and I'm going to change the uh, I'm going to keep that to watch so I just put um, create website so basically this is going to go through every single video and it's going to create me a video there uh, that's because that specific video didn't have a keyword so probably okay videos found so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this specific folder once it finished it's creating the, the, the site right now okay so I'm going to go to the page where I create that which is going to be called uh, website marketing and here I can see all the pages that it did so it just created one page but I'm going to open it and I'm going to see what it creates okay I'm just going to go there and check what it creates what page did it was created Okay, so as so you can see, it opened Dreamweaver here, and it opened me the page where it's going to show me all the information here. So I just go back here, and I can see here four principles of marketing description. It has me all those things, and then I can just go to preview in Firefox. As you can see here, is just the video. It doesn't show me everything. So it showed me this for principles of marketing. I can get the description of that specific video and then I can get images from the other videos. This is not finished. It's not a it's not a product finished, but as you can see it's like very nice what you can do with that. So you just like hover over the video and then just click play and it's going to if it did it properly, it's it will go to to your other site which would be the the other page that was created along this one so this is what you can do with uh, web scraping this is like only the basic you can do much more than this I'm just showing you like some of the amazing things that are possible if you learn how to do this so hopefully you like this course if you want to sign up, just uh, enroll on this course and you will be learning like all these amazing techniques to do everything that I show you. So just like a, just like a side note, these are like what you're going to do. So you see all these videos you get it into a table, all these ads you get it into a table and then with that table you can save those into excel files and then you can uh, like use it for later you are extracting information from youtube from craigslist from google from facebook like you can see that this is like something awesome that you really need to know uh, how to do it so please sign up and if you have any questions just let me know I will be glad to help you. Uh, so again, my name is Juan Jose. I, 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 I will wait for you on this course. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.